Hello everyone and welcome to this video. So it seems like we have yet another interesting situation on our hands. And of course it is related to star coins and getting more than you actually should. We're obviously going to talk a little bit about it. So as always, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you do, make sure to subscribe. It really means a lot and now let's get into it. So if you don't know, it's currently Black Friday weekend, which means that SSO is coming out with a lot of offers, deals, free stuff, all of that. We've already gotten two new redeem codes that are for three days of free Star Rider and, and five garden powders. We all got a week of free stable care and there's a bunch of horse discounts, pet discounts, and I think clothing discounts going on in the game. But in real life with real money, we currently have a double star coins like discount or I guess deal going on. And some people have had an interesting issue with it. Double star coins is when you basically pay for a set amount of star coins, but you get double that amount for the same money. SSO comes out with this offer, I think every month at the end of the month. So if you're ever like craving some star coins and don't have them yet and want to buy them, I would definitely wait until the end of the month. But anyway, what has happened to quite a lot of people around this time is that they bought double star coins, but instead of getting double double the star coins they should have but they actually got like double of the double star coins so if they bought 5000 star coins which is an offer that gives you 10000 star coins during the double star coins deal because it is 5000 plus 5000 they actually got 20000 which is a very interesting bug or error that I wouldn't mind getting, honestly. At the same time, if this has happened to you, I wouldn't spend that money because you never know when SSO might take it away. It is currently the weekend and I believe they don't work during the weekends, which means that this is an issue that they're not going to look into until Monday. So if you got a double star coins offer and still have too many star coins, I wouldn't spend the excess amount. So if you got 10,000 star coins and wanted to go on a horse shopping spree, but now have 20,000, I would just spend 10,000 and wait because you never know if SSO might take it away and actually put you in debt because that has happened a few times now. We know of some very publicized cases when SSO accidentally added too many star coins to a player that bought them and then they took them away, but the player had already spent all of these star coins and they were literally put into debt. And instead of having, I don't know, a few hundred, a few ten, or maybe even just a handful of star coins, they had minus star coins, which meant that their weekly allowance went towards their debt. I think at least for the most publicized case that got resolved and SSO basically put them at zero star coins, so they had to start off from scratch. A lot of people aren't as lucky and they basically have to wait until their balance is in the positives. Obviously, if you are ever put into debt in SSO because of an error on their part, I would definitely contact like each and every influencer, any like content creator, anyone with any kind of platform, especially on Instagram, because they'll give you the voice and that is basically the only way that SSO will resolve your issue because their customer support is very interesting. Now, if this has happened to you, do not be worried. You're not going to get banned or suspended or anything like that. But again, if you bought it like 10,000 star coins and now got 20,000, I would just spend 10,000. But one thing that I definitely wouldn't do is I wouldn't contact the support team about this because who knows what they're going to accuse you of and then you're 100% going to lose the star coins, like the excess star coins that you got. But if you stay quiet about this whole situation and, you know, a month goes by and you still have all of the excess star coins that you got, I mean, find their keepers. I don't think they're going to be looking at this specific thing in like a month. So if you still have it by that point, I don't think they're going to take it away because obviously they're going to have a bunch of different offers going on at that time and 
they're not going to be looking at specific cases. Obviously, this doesn't happen to everyone and I'm not sure how hard it would be for SSO to find each and every account that this has happened to. So if you just stay quiet and keep the extra star coins for a month, you're guaranteed not going to be in debt, first of all. And second of all, if SSO doesn't remove them, you're still going to have them. Throughout the years, there's definitely been a lot of glitches where players got double star coins during Saturdays or maybe when they bought star coins. And not every time SSO took them away. So if you're careful and patient, you might get to keep them as a reward. Honestly, I do find this situation a little funny because how does that even happen? And I feel like the funnier or maybe like sad thing about this is that SSO like always kind of turns it around and blames the players. I don't know any, I mean, I don't really play many other games, but I don't really know that many companies that would do that. Though I do feel that a lot of companies do hate their player bases. So maybe SSO isn't even that bad. But yeah, I really don't know how... SSO will like resolve this issue if they will even try. I don't know if they have to go on case by case basis or if they can just like check if anyone got 20,000 while paying for 10,000. I like I have no idea but at the same time the possibility of them banning or suspending anyone is like literally zero because obviously this was an error on their part but I do find it kind of funny because I think it was a glitch in the game during some new quests that we got you completed the quest but then there was like the timer where you have to wait until the next day to actually continue the quest and a lot of players stayed the night which i think cost like 75 star coins or something like that and the quest didn't like continue it still said that you have to wait until the next day so they basically spend their star coins for nothing and SSO said that yes this is a bug but it's kind of the player's fault and at first they said that they wouldn't reimburse the players for their lost star coins but then there was enough uproar that I think they did return the star coins. But I just found that situation absolutely insane. Imagine having a glitch in your own game and then players like buy something. It's not even like they glitched or they were like doing something that goes against the terms of service of the game. They literally bought an item that you can buy they didn't get the thing they bought and then the company basically said well sucks to be you there's been a few situations like this one and i don't know i think they're kind of sad but they're sad to the point they're kind of funny i mean obviously if this happened to me i would be very mad but yeah i just i don't know i don't know what they're thinking but I, again, I'm not sure how they're going to resolve this situation, but good luck to everyone who got the extra star coins. I'm definitely very jealous, but yeah, this is a situation that I just wanted to talk about a little. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video as always, and I'm gonna see you in my next one. Bye!